crap. It smells like washed up horseshoe crabs, dead fish, and feet. But this does not smell like that. This actually smells quite nice. Hey guys, so first off, I have two furry dogs in here right now that you cannot see. But if you hear tip taps on the floor, that is why. One of which is my dog. She's right behind me. Again, you probably can't see her. Uh, and the other one, we are dog sitting for my in-laws. So they're both in here exploring. One just left, maybe the other one will too. Nope, she's laying down. She's not going anywhere. Okay, so today's video is going to be a Bath and Body Works haul, sort of, but not really, because I've already used some of the soaps out of necessity. <laughs> As I previously mentioned in my last video last week, um, I didn't have a camera for a while. Bought a bunch of stuff, couldn't show you guys because I didn't have a camera to film it on. So I'm filming it now, it's a little delayed. I have not used the candles, I have not used three of the soaps, three of the six soaps, but I wanted to show you guys anyway because these are kind of newer scents to me, a few of them are, and they're very summery and tropical and delicious. So we're gonna start with the soaps because that's kind of like the boring part that no one really cares about, but they are something that you need in life if you wanna have clean hands anyway, which I do. And we're gonna start with the soaps that I've already used <laughs> because it's easy and you can tell I've used them. Um, the first one I have here is iced guava colada and it says it's fresh island guava, coconut milk, and a hint of vanilla. This is a totally new scent for me. I've never smelled this one before. They came in actually a six pack, all six of these soaps I'm gonna show you. And I think it was like $24 for all six of them. Ooh, it smells so good. There's a couple in here that I'm not too into. This is one that I really, really like and it would be a really good candle to have if they have this in a candle. That's one thing I'm gonna say, Bath and Body Works, sometimes you have soaps that you don't have candles for. Why? Why do you do that to me? I really like the scent and I want to smell it in my house, not just on my hands. Can you dog stop moving, please? You're kind of interrupting me. Thanks. Next up is cactus flower and coconut. This one says it's cactus flower, ice coconut, and lemon sugar. I'm gonna smell you, you dirty little soap. And it doesn't smell that good. I wouldn't want this in a candle. It doesn't smell bad, but it's not great either. It definitely is a little bit tutti fruity, but it's not as delicious as I'd like it to be. I like my soaps to smell like I wanna drink them, but I would never do such a thing because I know it'd probably kill me. So this doesn't have that effect. Next up is the most used one because it's been living in my kitchen where I wash my hands the most, and this is mango dragon fruit. Also, I want to apologize if my camera's not focusing because again, it's new and I'm still trying to work it out and I have it on my iPad here. Um, so I'm just trying to look and make sure that we are in focus, which right now we are. Can't guarantee we will be the whole time. Anyway, the description of this one is golden mango, lush pink dragon fruit, and sugar cane. And I do think I like this one a lot. Yeah, it smells nice. It's very mango-y. It's a lot of mango going on there, but it's good. Okay, now for the ones that I have not put out yet. This one is it's questionable. This isn't like a tropical smell to me. This is called cinnamon spice vanilla. What does that sound like? Fall, right? Christmas, right? Which I'm I'm a-okay with. My favorite time of the year, the two things I just mentioned, fall and Christmas. Um, this says it's rich vanilla and freshly ground cinnamon. Basic. Ooh, it just got all over my face. It's mad I called it basic. It is basic. It's literally vanilla and cinnamon. So not very tropical, but it smells good. It's just not, it doesn't go along with the rest of them. I don't get it. I don't know why this is in there. Next up, just wiping the cinnamon off my face, is salted pineapple punch. This is juicy pineapple and salted star fruit. Oh, haven't used this one. Let's see what you smell like. Ooh. Mm -mm. See, at first it's nice, and then literally there's like an aftertaste in my nose that's not so nice. Um, I'll wash my hands with it, but I don't want my house to smell like this. So it's okay, but I don't recommend. Doesn't get the April seal of approval. Now this one will though. This one will. This is Island Margarita. This is a staple in our household because my husband loves it and I love it and we have candles of it and now we have soaps of it as well. It's freshly squeezed lime kissed with sea salt. That's not really a sentence. Freshly squeezed lime kissed with sea salt. Oh, oh it is. It's a freshly squeezed lime kissed with sea salt. They missed the comma. Mmm, yep. It made my mouth water a little bit. You see that? I had to swallow. This is really good. I want to drink it. This is one I want to drink. This is one I want to drink. And this is one I want to drink. So if you're looking for two soaps, I definitely recommend these two for sure. And then this one, what are you called again? Mango dragon fruit, also delicious. Can you stop for real though? You're about to get kicked out of here. All right, let's go. I don't know if we're tippy tapping on the camera. We focused, focus on me, fo fo focus on me. 
had to kick the dogs out because the tippy tapping. I wasn't sure if you could hear it, but if you could, you can't now. Okay, so now I have four candles, which I'm so excited about because I hadn't really gotten candles in a while. I was trying to burn out my holiday, like Christmas ones, literally in like March and April, which is a little weird. Um, but I got these and I'm really excited to show you. I'm pretty sure none of them are ones I've had before. They're all new, I believe. Pretty sure. Okay, the first one is a guava piña colada. This one is described as the perfect answer to a hot sunny day. The fragrance of fresh... Fragrance. The fragrance of Fweshwi. The fragrance of freshly picked guava, creamy coconut milk, and orange flower. Mmm. That's good. Was this one I had here? Ice guava colada. Oh, it's guava pina colada. That's ice guava colada. <laughs> this is really nice. What's really fun too, I should mention, is I dragged my husband into Bath and Body Works with me to help pick these out. And I'm pretty sure he just wanted to get out of there. So he was like, yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, that sucks, uh, whatever. He, he liked this one, so this is really good. It's, it, it smells like a Starburst. It smells like a pink Starburst tastes. If you're wondering why I'm a little energetic right now, Monster, sponsor me. God, I hope I'm in focus. I can't tell, I just can't tell. Next up is Tiki Mango Mai Tai, and I actually have this body wash at work, so I can't show it to you right now, but I'll be using it in the, oh my God, it smells so good. This is my new favorite smell in the world. Um, I'll be using it in the locker room and people will be like, what's that smell? It smells so good. And I'm like, oh, that's me. Just, just me over here showering. <laughs> the description of this is, Drink in a tropical blend of mango, nectar, jasmine flower, and sun-kissed grapefruit. Now, who wants to hula? <laughs> yeah, this one's really, 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 really good. Like, I cannot. If you like that tangy, really tropical drink sort of smell, get this. Trust me. Next up is Fiji White Sand, and this one is described as sail away to a South Seas paradise in a fragrance made from fresh-cut sugarcane, white nectarine, and sun-drenched sandalwood i really like this one a lot when i first read this i was like what what sand i don't want what it what what does sand smell like crap it smells like washed up horseshoe crabs dead fish and feet but this does not smell like that this actually smells quite nice mm, yeah i really like this one too not quite as good as the mango tiki mai tai is that what it's called tiki mango mai tai dyslexia but it is very good very very nice I like all of them. Typically I buy my candles online and I just read the descriptions and then buy them and hope for the best. But this time I actually went to the store so I knew I was gonna like all of them. This next one is, um, I really like the jar, first of all, but I'm not a big fan of not having a lid. I'm not gonna lie, like this is the lid. Um, the name is Ocean Driftwood and it says bring back, not bring back, nope, didn't say that. It says bring home the luxurious laid back fragrance of beachside oak and opulent mahogany wash who writes this? Mahogany washed smooth by the Caribbean Sea. This one was like more of a masculine cologne sort of scent. This is definitely something that I believe my husband really liked, but it is something that I could see like a man wearing. What's the one that ma mahogany teak would? That makes sense actually, because this also has mahogany in the description, but it smells a lot like that. That's what it reminds me of, but like a beachy version of it. I do like it, quite nice. It's a very mature scent, which I'm not usually interested in. I like young, fruity scents, just like myself. Okay guys, so that is it for my new Bath and Body Works stuff video. Have you guys ever smelled any of these? Do you like any of the ones I mentioned? Do you not like any of the ones I mentioned? Do you have some that I didn't mention that you like that I should like? Leave them below, let me know, I'd like to hear about it. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next week, bye. Okay.